In this video, I just wanted to quickly go over what change rotation point means and how it can be used to your benefit. So change rotation point can be found right here underneath the rotate section in your transform box in autopilot. With change rotation point, if I have that check marked and I select a pattern, gray circles appear in different sections around the pattern and one in the center, determining where you can rotate from when you use change rotation point. So a benefit of that would be if I took this pattern and placed it in the center of this Dresden, I placed the start and end point right there at the center of this Dresden, and I chose change rotation point, and I selected down here at the bottom where that start and end point is, my rotation handle will move down to that point. And now if I click and hold on the circle out here, I can rotate this pattern from that center point that I chose. So I can place this exactly where I want in that Dresden blade, let's say right about there. And then if I wanted to use wreath for this section to fill it all up, I could open up my wreath tool, preview that, and it's going to throw them in there. So using change rotation point can get that perfect rotation to place that pattern wherever you would like.